that's a two pounder. You need the measuring? Nah. <laughs> Hey guys, Stephen Turner here with Turner Fishing. So, Panoptics Live Scope. It's been out for a while now. And, you know, honestly, in my opinion, it has revolutionized the fishing industry. So, I finally had an opportunity as, you know, an average Joe, a normal weekend. Well, I don't really go on the weekends, but a weekday angler that just... I mean, can't show about four thousand dollars. I finally got a, a chance to try it. We went out with a guy named Dwayne. He has a live scope, and he gave us an opportunity. He put me at the front of the boat, told me to do whatever I wanted. So I got to play with it a little bit. But I'm gonna show y'all guys a couple clips, and then we're gonna talk about my opinion on live scope itself. And is it cheating? Um, does it make you a better angler? All that stuff. So, y'all check this out. I'm going to show y'all the clips. I'm about to shoot some bluegrass jigs. And I'll see y'all after the Come on, fishy. I see you. That's a big one, too. Come on. Oh, he's looking at it. Come on. <laughs> I see you looking at it. God damn it. All right, here he comes. You, you gonna bite it? Yes, you are. <laughs> that's, hell yeah, that's too damn cool. Huh? That's, that's too damn cool. <laughs> Controller motor? Yeah, hey, that's, a, that's a two pounder. <laughs> <laughs> you need the measuring? Nah. <laughs> I ain't even catching with the live scope, though. I was looking at the wrong spot. Like what? So I was looking at the wrong spot. No, the one bites the dust. I put in about 25. What's that old boy? I was no in person. I got right in that school that time. Oh. Oh, we got off. Oh, don't break me. God. <laughs> no, he bent my hook. Man, my boat's small. I just flipped him in. <laughs> hey, that worked. All right. A little run of blue ice. Not blue eyes, uh, blue grass, blue grass. <laughs> so, as y'all seen from the clips, I mean, live scopes are freaking, it's a fun thing. It's, it's a game changer, honestly. Honestly, see why all the people around my area were never did good in tournaments. And now, you know, the ones that can afford it are just popping off going around the country winning these crappy tournaments. Anyways, let me get off that subject. But live scope as a casual fisherman amazing tool amazing tool as a beginner if you're struggling with crappy if you're struggling with bass uh, you're struggling with any kind of fish that swims you can watch him on your depth finder come up and eat your bait you know exactly where the fish are positioned you and you know exactly where the fish react to your bait you know exactly where the brush pile limb is so you never get hung again is it fair if you can afford it and everybody else has got one yeah it's fair everybody can go from dock to dock to brush pile to brush pile to cane pile to cane pile oh well let me pull up on this cane pile 
oh they ain't no four to five pounders on it so it's not worth fishing let me go to the next one and the next one oh well there's four to five pounders let me fish for them and see if i can catch them oh they're not biting let me do the same thing over all right we're crappy let me go to this brush pile well there's only eight to ten inches here that's not going to win me a tournament let me go to this brush pile well there's one 14 to 15 inch crappy swimming right there so i'm putting my jig directly in front of it and catching that's what live scope is take it for what you can you can hit a dislike button that's my opinion live scope is a phenomenal technology and eventually i will have it and i will use it it's a, a, a freaking phenomenal advantage to anybody it takes out all the guesswork you don't have to idle around well you still got to find a brush piles with side image and i'll give you that you still got to find them but you don't have to ride over them with down image you don't have to scare the fish off anymore you take your live scope you point it at the new brush pile you just found wait a little bit see if there's any fish if there's not go but eventually gonna have it though garmin if you're watching this hook me up because man i could catch some fish with that thing <laughs> anyway guys that's my honest opinion on it casual fishing love it go out there and catch you some big old slabs and some big old bass tournament fishing i hate it because i can't afford one and that's just an average joe's opinion you know it's I don't think I will fish a crappy tournament until I got one because the amount of an, an advantage crappy fishing is extreme. Bass fishing, I'll still do bass fishing tournaments. That don't bother me. I'm a shallow water angler. I don't. I mean, what am I going to do? Look under the dock I'm fishing, which probably works. I mean, but anyway, guys, I'll catch you on the next one.